Hi, this is John Carney, Product Engineer at Cadence. This is a how-to video on using placement files in ORCAD Expresso. Placement files can be very useful if you have explicit XY locations for connectors coming in from a mechanical tool, or perhaps you have placement from a layout done and some other software that you need to quickly import into the ORCAD X environment. Placement files are a very easy way to accomplish that. To generate a placement file, you can go into the manufacturing menu and choose export placement. You'll be prompted for the name and location for the placement file, which by default goes into the working directory. And then you can decide whether or not you want the placement coordinates to be based upon the symbol's origin or pin one of the symbol. And just go ahead and hit export and then you'll have your placement file. This is what the placement file looks like. You don't have to export the placement file. I'm just showing you this syntax because you can also build a placement file from scratch if you would like. What I wanna point out to you here is that the placement file effectively has a couple of columns. The reference designator of the component, the X location, the Y location, the rotation, whether it's mirrored, top or bottom, the PCB footprint symbol name, and then if it's an embedded component, if it's on an embedded layer. With this information and this syntax, you could easily produce this placement file for your entire design or even subsets of your design. Notice this is delimited with exclamation marks. So you can also bring that into Excel and create it using an Excel file like this, where you just put the different columns in different columns in Excel and then separate those by exclamation marks. And then when you're done, just make sure to save that off as a basic Unicode.txt file. And then you can import that back in to ORCAD Expresso. So for example, let's say you just had four specific connectors that you wanted placed at specific XY locations and rotations. You could make this placement file. You could probably gather this data that you may export from some other CAD system. Very easy to create this file format and just create it and save it off to disk. Back in Presto, you can then import that placement file. Under the ECO menu, choose Import Placement and then browse to that placement file on disk. And then again, you have a couple options of whether or not the origin is going to be on the symbol origin or pin one. You can use this to add unplaced components. So if you have components that haven't even been placed inside the board outline, you can do that. Or you can say just add and move components, ignore locked and place components by the component symbol, which would mean place it from the library part or just move the symbol based upon what's in the design. Once you've run the import process, all the components that were in that placement file will be placed in their appropriate XY location, rotation, and mirroring options.